Hello, this is Mark of Tech Pinas, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the all-new PLDT Home Wi-Fi, which is powered by Smart LTE. So this is currently the most budget-friendly option from PLDT for browsing the internet. And as such, it is perfect for budget-conscious millennials, young professionals, small business owners, and even families who want to browse the internet at home or in their home office without subscribing to a postpaid line. Okay, so join me in my initial unboxing of this device, its initial setup, and let's also do some speed tests to try out just how fast internet is using the PLDT Home Wi-Fi. Alright, join me! Let's go! Let's start with PLDT Home Wi-Fi's packaging. As you can see, the outer sleeve shows key information about the product, including the quick setup process. Removing the sleeve, we see the white box itself, which is sealed to prevent tampering. Cutting the seal and lifting the lid, we are greeted by the device. Here's the complete PLDT Home Wi-Fi retail package. Let's take a look at each item. Here's the unit itself. The included DC power adapter has a fairly long 1.5 meter cable. This device was made by Evolution and these are the product guide and the warranty certificate. If your laptop is not Wi-Fi enabled, use this Ethernet cable to connect to the device. Read the user guide on how to connect to the internet using the PLDT Home Wi-Fi which, as I've shared, is powered by Smart LTE. The Smart Data SIM comes pre-installed and sealed inside the product. Now I'll show you how to set up the PLDT Home Wi-Fi. It's actually very easy. First, just install the two plastic feet that come with the package. Then, simply plug in the DC power adapter to the device and to a nearby electric outlet. And finally, just turn on your PLDT Home Wi-Fi to start browsing the internet. Just wait for all of the LED lights to turn green and then you can already connect your Wi-Fi devices to this product. To begin browsing the web via PLDT Home Wi-Fi, simply connect to it and type in your password. The default password of PLDT Home Wi-Fi is PLDT Home. To change this, simply visit pldthomewifisettings.net. To log in, type in PLDT Home as both your username and password. Once you've signed in, just click on Settings. Under Settings, go to Wi-Fi Settings. In Wi-Fi Security section, choose WPA2 PSK as your security mode. And then, pick TKIP AES as your WPA algorithm. After which, simply type in your new desired password in the box provided. Once you're done, just click the Apply button. You will then be disconnected from your PLDT Home Wi-Fi device and you'd have to reconnect using your new password. PLDT Home Wi-Fi supports up to 5 connected devices. Now let's run speed test on my Samsung Galaxy smartphone which is connected to PLDT Home Wi-Fi here in our house in Metro Manila. Okay, in real-world use, as shown in these speed test results, PLDT Home Wi-Fi was able to give me 10.9 Mbps download speed and 8.65 Mbps upload speed, which are not bad at all for a prepaid data connection. So, is the PLDT Home Wi-Fi the right internet device for you? Well, if you want to enjoy fast, reliable, and affordable internet connection at home, in your home office, condo, or boarding house without installation or monthly bills, go ahead and try out PLDT Home Wi-Fi. Alright, so there you have it. It's a PLDT Home Wi-Fi. And you can now get this product for only 1895 with free 10 gigabytes of data, which is valid for 7 days. So if you have questions about PLDT Home Wi-Fi, leave them in the comment section below. Alright? 
Bye for now.